something is killing baby raccoons at Hope for Wildlife. And whatever it is, it's spreading. That me looks like a sample. Allison is rushing some samples and two dying raccoons to Dr. Barry for examination. All the ones that died have the sunken in, sort of goopy in the corner eyes. Okay. All of them have diarrhea. Okay. Um, but I know we didn't. And um, were they sick for a while? It's been very fast. Like there has been like two or three dropping weight. Yeah. But one minute they're lapping milk and the next minute they're dying. And they're having diarrhea? Yeah. And some of them are like puking up their milk after we do feed them. You look sick. By the time Allison arrives, one raccoon has already died. How pale he is too. Yeah. He's white as a ghost. If you look at um, how white he is instead of pink, like up in here, it should kind of be the same as, I'm not going to touch my own lips right now, yeah. but kind of like your own gums are nice and pink. That kind of lets you, gives you an indication of, um, of red blood cells. So we're going to euthanize this one as well because he's terribly dehydrated. We were, Barry was giving him sort of a poke and a prod and there's something very bothersome in his stomach. Um, but yeah, he's, he's really, really dehydrated. If this raccoon was perfectly healthy, he'd be running around and all over the place, but I don't even think he knows what's going on, really. He's just kind of trying to figure it all out. So, and of course the machines don't run raccoons, so I ran him as a dog. Right. Um, and according to the machine, he has no white blood cells. Okay. Um, he has 0.3 times 10 to the, the third, and normal is 6 to 17. So pretty low. Yeah. Um, and the technician's taking a look at the smear, and there's no white blood cells on the smear either. So okay. that would be consistent with panleukopenia, which kind of mean, implies no leukocytes. This is just a sedative. I just put some narcotic with some some actual sedative, and we're going to give him this in the, into the muscle. Um, it's going to make it very relaxed, and then we're going to euthanize him. Okay, little guy, it's going to hurt a little bit, a little pinch. Oh, what a brave fella, huh? The first needle is just a sedative. The narcotic takes effect quickly. So I like to sedate them first, just because to try and get a vein on this little guy is going to be really tough. Um, whereas now he's sedated, so I'll just go directly into the heart. Okay. So I'm going to wrap him up. In just two days, more than 50 raccoons have died and the outbreak shows no signs of slowing down. Hello, beautiful. Hello.